Last time on Gex, I was fighting some ninjas. So, now there are two dead ninjas. And I guess something happened. I don't know what. Uh, disappearing stuff. Okay, I still need 20 more masks to go, and somehow I doubt I'm going to have enough. Because that's how these levels always work. They give you not quite enough to make... Uh, that sucked. Yeah, they give you, like, two routes to go on, and if you follow one of them, you won't have enough. If you follow the other one, you probably still won't have enough. So you have to go on both of them, and that's really annoying. Alright, so yeah, I gotta kill this dragon here. Uh, doing that, I guess, will get me the remote, but crap. Maybe if I actually... I wonder if I died and those enemies came back, I'd be able to get more. That might not be the worst idea. I'm gonna die on purpose. And see how that goes. Which way do I want to go? I really don't know. I probably came out of that window at some point. And... Come on, give me some stuff. Okay, I'm just going to go this way because I'm guessing here. Yeah, I remember the used junk when I broke open, so... There we go awful freaking camera. I know I complain about it a lot, but it's just so easy to complain about. Come on, give me the stuffs. Pick up the sprites. Kill the giant scorpions. Okay, yay. So now I guess I'll go kill that dragon. It might take me a month to get back there, but at least I didn't have to redo this whole segment again like I did in the last level. That would suck. And I'm sure it's going to happen again. Maybe even in Frankensteinfeld. Is that... Oh my god. That level I remember having a lot of split paths. I doubt that any one path is going to have enough collectibles in it, and it's going to be terrible, and I'm going to probably pee all over the place. I will pee all over my pants, and then he's going to end up looking bad. That would be a quote from Master Shake from Aquatain Hunger Force. If you don't watch that, you should. It's a good show. Well, actually, I haven't even watched it in a really long time, so I can't really say that, but the first four or so seasons were good. I don't know how many seasons there are. I haven't really seen anything after that, and I haven't seen the movie. Okay, so the thingy thing, 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 the thing, thing goes up. I will use my gecko-based powers as... oh god. Must kill the shiny Gyarados. No, it doesn't actually look anything like a Gyarados. That's just what it reminded me of. Uh, come on, turn. This thing is quite annoying to hit when it's small like that, which I realize is the point. But it's still annoying. Okay, it's dead. That magically causes a door to open. Oh god, there's more? If there's collectibles in here, I'm gonna be kinda of ticked off. There are! Oh man. There might not be enough though. Yeah, there's only six from those two. So, yeah, I still probably had to die. Okay, no big deal. So, this level is now half finished. And. Do I get a bonus level? Yes, I do. Yay. I knew I was due for one pretty soon. In Dragnet. That's a very strange name. Okay, it actually gave me this camera angle to work with as I came out of the level. Now that's just awful. 
Okay, so this next one I will apparently be crossing some rocking pillars. And I... Uh, I don't remember which door I went in last time. Medical supply and clothing. I think it was clothing, because I was near it after I got the thing from here. So I'm going to guess that it's this one. But I, but I need to go in. Don't need to collect stuff. Wait, there's a door there. There might have been something in it. So I have to break open all the doors to make sure that I find the silver remote. Oh no, that just leads outside. Okay, never mind. And of course I fell. Uh -huh. uh, exploring, exploring. Gecko, gecko, gecko. If you watched my Mitch LP, you would know that I really, really hate Dora the Explorer. So I'm not sure why I was making a reference to it. Ah! This reminds me of Ape Escape. I think there was a thing like that in that game. Screw you! We. That was cool. No, I didn't want to go on it again. It's going to drop me off on the floor, isn't it? Yes, it is. Uh, 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 uh. Okay, let's get past the thingies. Wait a second. Nope, it's just those. I thought the... Uh, I guess that would be too easy of a place to hide the silver remote. But I had to check anyway. Don't care. Come on, I want to finish up this level. Uh, forced camera yet again. Can I at least look? No, it won't let me go into first person here. Because this game sucks. More of these things. Or actually just one. Okie dokie. And what the heck is this? Oh, I think those floor tiles will flip over if you kill the ninjas. And then you'll get the yin yang thing that you can jump high on. I do remember a few vague things from this game. I did, I did play through the whole thing like twice. It has to show both of them. Because showing one isn't sufficient. Uh, okay. I think the silver remote in this level is behind a random destroyable wall. It like doesn't look like it's destroyable, so I'm, that's why I'm hitting all these walls. Come on. that stupid thing. Okay, I hit two gongs, and that does what? Oh, it opens up that wall. Yeah, come on, Greg. You have to realize that it is Chinatown. And then something will happen. More walls that I have to arbitrarily check. Wait, this is the room with the pillars in it. I wonder if it's actually in here. I bet it's not. I'm sure I passed it long ago. Weird camera angle, and there's something behind that wall, it looks like. Or maybe it's just the other room. Ah, uh, damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it. And we're going to find that silver remote now. I 
was that? I very faintly heard like a hi ya thing. It wasn't even in Gex's voice. Come on, let's cross these things before my 11 minutes are up. I guess next segment I will be searching for that silver remote, much to my dismay. But other than that, we're done in this level. That hidden one is a lot more hidden than any other one so far. And I guess I'll also be doing the in Dragnet level, because I want to do that one. And then I will hesitantly go into Frankensteinfeld. Why hesitantly? Because I remember it being kind of confusing, and also because I'm out of quotes for the scary levels to use as titles for the videos. But anyways, that's it. See you next time.